Well, lads, what's the crack? My name is Orgy Runner, and welcome to Stray Souls, an indie horror demo that's somewhat sort of like Silent Hill. It's very Silent Hill inspired, is what I'm trying to say. I saw John Wolf play it there a few months ago. I only saw like a minute or two of it. I didn't want to spoil it too much for myself. And I thought, seeing as I don't have much content up at the moment, I thought I'd just throw up some sort of short ish horror game. Because I'm not really playing a lot of horror games at the moment. I suppose I am playing Dead Space, but I've been mostly focused around the. Uh, the what you call it life is strange series speaking of life is strange i've been saying it for a while on my life is strange videos that i probably wouldn't be playing life is strange true colors for a while until it drops further in price but luckily enough there was a sale for it in smith's which is a local toy and video game store where where i'm from but they didn't have it but fret not amazon exists so yeah, I ordered this on Sunday for the PS5 for the same price that I saw it in, in Smith's. And yeah, got it yesterday. Yesterday was, what day every day? We are Wednesday, I do believe. Wednesday, yeah. Yeah, so I ordered this on Sunday and I got it Tuesday. That is fast. That wasn't even with Amazon Prime. That was regular delivery. That was so fast and I can't wait to get into this Anywho focusing on the horror game that we have now. Oh god the brightness the brightness in the back shit um, Never mind it doesn't matter as long as you can see my face. It should all be good So either way, let's get right into this game. Is my controller working? Yes, it is Yeah, that that menu sound or that option select sound that is very very sun esque so uh, yeah I've um, high hopes going into this game well I won't say too high hopes but I hope it is somewhat decent it's only a demo by the way if I hadn't said that before oh we are looking fresh look at that mop and that facial expression though Okay, so you're going to do that, are you? Good. Let me turn down the volume a small bit. Martha, how much longer are you going to keep me waiting in this stump? Just a sec. Look, I really appreciate that you're going through all this trouble for my birthday, but I'm seriously bored just standing around out here. Relax, it's almost ready. I swear that you got me out of it just a bit in a hurry. Dude, chill out, man. Just call me when you find the graveyard. Okay, I'll keep looking around. Oh, and he's got a Nokia 3310. Ooh, that is fancy. Is that going to be our main weapon of choice? Are we going to use it to bash our enemies to death? Probably. Come on, get with the times. Get with the memes. You've got to use that as a weapon. All we have to do is find a stick and some tape, And it's like Thor's hammer. Okay, so current objective. Look around and find the graveyard. Ooh, spooky. We have to find a graveyard. And that wind is very loud. So yeah, it look, looks nice. What the fuck just came up there? Probably nothing. Yeah, so far, so glum, so gloomy. I like those facial animations, though. Cool, it's very smooth, very slick. And of course we have the fog as well. It can't be a Silent Hill clone without fog. Is this a grave? Is this a, is this, is this a grave we're looking for? Look around. Uh, okay. Mm, no. It's a whole lot of nothing. Right. So it just seems to be showing off the mechanics and the sort of focal point, the focal blur, the background blur, which is kind of cool, it's nice, but unless there's anything to do here, it's, it's a wasted effort, kind of. I don't know, throwing in stuff like this for the sake of the game looking nice is not, uh, how to say, very necessary. I mean, polished graphics and background blur does not a good game make. Oh, where was it? Is this a graveyard? It is. I found the graveyard, but it's fenced in and I haven't figured out how to get in there yet. 
Hop over it, you mop it up, moron. Ooh, that is fancy. I don't... I don't know what to say. That's... that's something. Thank you. I... I really mean it. Easy on the merchant stuff, little man. I'm glad you enjoyed it. It was a real bitch to put together. By the way, you remember why we're really here, right? To watch fireworks and a creepy forest on my birthday? Ooh, you've got jokes, huh? I'm here to look for the gravestone, I remember. Okay, well, while I make my way back to you, see if you can find a way into the graveyard. Yes, ma'am, will do. By the way, thanks again, Marty. Thanks, Morty. I love the fireworks. It means a lot. What the fuck is going on with my game? Maybe one of the rangers left their keys in the car? What, what, what? What, what, why would you need a key to get into the graveyard? Why not use your canoodle and hop the fence? I don't even understand why rangers would have a key to a graveyard. Jesus Christ, these things look heavy. What you might, they look heavy. Dude, I lift 50 inch to 65 inch TVs out every day. Well, I use a, a trolley to, to do it because I work in retail. And you're telling me these are heavy? Unless they have like 20 kilograms of fucking concrete in them, sure, I might believe you. Oh. Okay, or maybe the wheels might be very rusted. Who knows? Come on, dude, put your back into it. Wait, what, 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 what? Oh, okay, well, uh, well, that was handy. I better find some keys in this goddamn car. Oh, God, those trolleys, it must be so heavy. Okay. Son of a bitch. Of course it's locked. Of course, you just used a key to try and get in. What is wrong with this mop top idiot? Okay, so we have another... What it, the fuck is going on? I keep seeing something flash up on my screen here. Ah, uh, another trolley puzzle. Come on, dude. <laughs> I believe in you. Jesus, what the hell is wrong with you? You have some sort of muscle problem or something? Muscle dystrophy or something, whatever it's called. That you can't move uh, something as light as a trolley. Dude, seriously, you need to get yourself checked out. Well, this sucks. I figure out some way to open this. Search the area for clues now to get into the vehicle. Okay, right, that's very vague. What kind of clues are we looking for? Oh, oh, wait, oh, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Don't worry about it right now. Wait, what do you mean by you don't need to worry about it right now? Do you work as a rubbish man or something? Do you collect trash? Is, is that your day job? Is that your part-time job? What about this building here? Looks very auspicious. Oh, got a note. Oh, this is a clue. <clears throat> Okay, let's read this out. Okay. So is this from Emmett or to Emmett? Nah, whatever. Since you can't be bothered to show up to work on time, I clocked out and went home. The car keys are hidden in the usual spot. Since I know you never pay attention, the usual spot means they're behind one of the cross-shaped tombstones. I'm pretty sure even you can figure that out. Okay, me. Wonderful. Treasure hunt that may be a complete waste of Okay, so back to the graveyard we go, I guess. So find a cross-shaped tombstone. Get out of my way, crow! Wait, um... You alright there, Mr. Crow? Okay, goodbye! Can I enter here? Eh, no. 
cross-shaped tombstone. Wait, what? Whoa, whoa. That wasn't there before. Did, did someone die and have a funeral service for the two plus minutes I was gone? Jeez. I'm telling you. The funeral homes, they work their ass off over in America, apparently. Like, uh, how did ass get here so fast? Oh, and there are the keys. And another note. You idiot. You left your sidearm laying out on a bench and some kids found it. They managed to pop a hole in one of the steam pipes in the electrical room. I chased them, but they managed to ditch the gun somewhere. Probably in a trash can, but I don't have time to look for it. Find your damn gun. You're lucky that I'm too tired to tell the chief about this. You owe me big time, jackass. Okay, right, whatever. I can't believe that worked. <laughs> Maybe these are the right keys. Shit. Finding that gun might not be a bad idea. Just in case. Okay, we gotta find a gun, find a gun, find a gun, find a gun, find a gun. Um, 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 oh, there's a, oh. <laughs> I have no idea what the hell is going on with my computer right now. Just a trash can here. Well, in here. Besides that lovely smell. And there's a big area here. So it could be something around here. Maybe, maybe, maybe not. Oh, here's another trash can. This would have been easily missable. Happy birthday to me. Oh, happy birthday to you. Dude, are you okay? Are you okay? Like, you seem way too excited to have found a gun. Well, then again, I suppose we did hear the rumblings, the growlings of something over yonder way. So LT to aim, RT to shoot, standard gun controls. All right. And the right shoulder button is to... Put it away and take it out. So what are we searching for here? Oh, that's a key. What what whoa, whoa, excuse the hell out of you? Watch what you're clipping through, my boy. Check the playground key. Check for the playground key in one of the cars. Oh. Oh, so we have to go to the playground. Ah. Why does my game keep doing that? Finally, the playground key. Time to relive my childhood and ride the slide. Okay, get her riding a slide somewhere. And, oh, here's the playground. Is there a bit of a shortcut I can take? Oh, yes, there is. Is there a gate here or something or what? Oh, 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 don't get stuck, don't get stuck. Ah. You know, you could just easily hop the fence. Just saying, you have enough clearance here just to give a running jump. But, you, you know, horror games, they don't use common sense and... Ooh, that is a scary looking Silent Hill monster, if I do say so myself. Uh-oh, 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 oh god, there's lots of them. Check my rear, just be sure that there's no one coming up behind me. Okay, hey, buddy boy, buddy. Yeah, I'm right here. Headshot, headshot, oh, down he goes. Reload, exit reload. Yeah, that's right, charge at me, buddy boy. Oh, 
Oh, down you pop. Oh, you see that? He had little faces on him as well. Okay, nice attention to detail there. And oh, oh, that's nice. See where the pools of blood are? It actually does uh, reflections. That's a very nice touch. Looks very shiny. That's cool. That's very, very cool. Are there more? What's up with that crow? You are right there, buddy? I guess he's perpetually stuck at that one spot. Uh, I hear another one. And I see another one. Oh, oh, oh. <gasps> oh. Yeah, down you go, buddy. And he seems awfully calm in this situation. Oh, wait, no. He, he, he's got a look of fear in his face. It's a nice touch. Never mind, we power on. Power onwards is what I meant to say. Hey! Yo! Come on, today, Junior! Don't have all day for you to run towards me. And walk away from the explosion without looking at it like a badass. Ammo. What the fuck keeps happening over there on my screen? I guess there's something going on in the background, maybe, that I'm unaware of. Okay, there's one more. Oh, here you are. here I uh, know but it, I, I'd be running the fuck away investigate the playground no how about you investigate getting the hell out of here investigate sorry yeah tripped over my words again so you something about riding the slide I'm hearing footsteps Wait, were those my footsteps? Okay, I guess they were. What about this old child's playhouse? What's going on with this? I'm assuming there's something I have to find. But you said ride the slide. Okay, and I'm seeing nothing here. Nothing at all. Oh wait, there's another slide. This one, perhaps? No. Uh huh. Can they go up the slide this way? Oh no, and this is barrier. Damn. Curse you, invisible barrier. How dare you stop me from reliving my childhood dreams of riding the slide? Basketball? Shoot some hoops, get that slam dunk? No? X marks the spot, does that mean anything? Come on, you're so vague. Wait, 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 wait what's, what's this? Nice. Looks like I'm in Andy. Am I missing something? Why would it come in handy? And why is it that you have a bottomless arse pocket that you can apparently put everything and anything into? Oh, 
Was ist denn hier? Ah. Oh, okay. This is something. This is a something something that I didn't take notice of before. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Don't get stuck. Don't get stuck. Yes, this game is pre-alpha, so it is due to be buggy. Hence why there's a lot of crows perpetually stuck in their position of flight. Can I kill them? Okay, all bugs will be forgiven by me if I can at least kill this crow. Fuck you. Okay, maybe that's just a bug. What about this crow? Surely, surely. Ozel! Okay, maybe I have a shit aim. How about this crow? No, these crows are invincible, apparently. They're not like the crows in Resident Evil and... Can I investigate this? Well, is there more ammo in this, maybe? Where's that stupid gun? There's so much crap everywhere. I'll never find it. Um... Are you okay, my dude? You literally have a gun attached to your arse pocket. In fact, right now, it's in your hand. Is this guy slow? Are, are you simple? Are you just simply normal or normally simple? I'm guessing the latter. I don't know. Oh no, I can't get through. Is this a glitch? Oh. No, 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 no. This. Oh, it's a valve puzzle. Hell yeah. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Okay, solve lever puzzle to unlock the underground door located outside. Okay, this seems easy. Seems straightforward. I mean, the instructions are right there. Up. down dude give it a chance you've only tried once I mean that room wasn't built in a day and this is going to go up and down right up down I think or I could be entirely There's wrong no way I'm this fucking dumb. well my dude you just bitched about not having a gun when clearly you had a gun on your person so, um, yeah, I, I am a bit worried about your, you know, mental capacity. Down. Up. So, what did this open? Oh, there's a green light in this. Oh, yeah, this, the, the light was red in this before, right? Right, 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 right. Oh, hello, gimpy little ghost child. Where do you go? Are you trying to lead the way? Okay, watch this now. He's gonna pop out from that corner and do the oogie boogie. I'm expecting it. I'm prepared for it. Yeah, and this is not the point where you're supposed to nope out of here and say, no, 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 ain't worth it. Ain't worth my time. That ghost ain't worth a dime of my time. What the, what sort of background pro program is going on or what kind of background process is going on that it keeps popping up on my screen uh, I don't know I'm not gonna worry about it too much ah so this is a graveyard so whose grave am I looking for oh let me guess let me guess I got a theory I got a theory theory time it's going to be my grave because apparently I am dead. That's what it's going to be. 
seen as this is sort of like Silent Hill esque. It's like um, a purgatory, a punishment for those that are damned to hell. And I, 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 I don't know. Silent Hill is like like a hell. It's like uh, people facing their demons. They're owning up to the crimes and nasty shit that they've done before. It's like a, a guilt trip. So yeah, I'm probably going to end up finding my own gravestone and it's going to have my name and I'll be like, oh, what the fuck, I'm dead. Why? How did this happen to me? But what gravestone am I looking for? There's, there's lots of gravestones here. I don't know. If through here is buried a pirate, maybe? Maybe because it's a skull and crossbones? Uh, or is it this very large one that's in front of me? In lump loving memory of. Can I read that from here? Oh. To be contundered! Uh, okay. Would you like to add stray souls to your wish list? Uh, yes, but no, but yes, but definitely no. <laughs> definitely no, definitely no. Um, Alright, so what did I think of it? It's kind of a polished game, but very unpolished at the same time. Then again, I shouldn't really be saying too much. It is in pre-alpha. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, what, what else? I mean, the dialogue was good. It was short, sweet, to the point. It seemed very professionally done, but I don't see this becoming a full game. I really don't. It seems like someone's passion slash college project. Because I did look a small bit into this game. I didn't spoil. I didn't spoil it enough for myself that um, I was go going into this. Fully prepared, if that makes sense. Because there's one one thing that I don't like doing is uh, seeing the outcome of a game and then pretending I haven't seen it. No, uh, right. So at the start of the game, I did say I watched John Wolves play like a minute or so of it. It looked kind of interesting. Just the intro, it looked fairly, uh, yeah, polished. That that's that was the hook for me. But from playing it myself. Like the mechanics, the, con the gun control, it seemed a bit, how did it say, heavy. Maybe it was because I was playing it on my controller. Maybe it's more for mouse and keyboard. Maybe it's oriented that way. I don't know. But uh, it's not that well fleshed out yet for me to have a decent opinion. Like, it, it is what it is. It is an alpha. But upon, upon like, researching it, it's like the studio's first game game or this person's first game and to be honest I think that they're fleshing it out or focusing too much on the presentation of it on how well it looks you have to go back to basics you have to get the basics right you have to make sure it functions first you have to make sure it functions perfectly or at least somewhat well before you can just uh, slap on Unreal Engine 5 graphics it's like putting uh, makeup on a pig in, in that sense. I mean, sure, it looks good, but the feel, it's not quite there yet. And I know that there is supposed to be like a huge background story to it. Again, very Sun Hill inspired. But I don't see it coming to fruition. I don't see it coming to fruition, whatever that the word is. It just seems a bit too ambitious at the moment. Because there's uh, smaller studios doing way more with a lot less, if that makes sense. Let's say, uh, how to, there's one studio I'm trying to think of. Um, they're a Japanese developer that they they publish, they've published a few short indie horror games within the past year, and they've been fairly decent. They've been an hour in length. What is what is that? Ch 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 chili, ch ch Chilla's art. Yeah, Chilla's art. Again, their games aren't really graphically intense but they do have a decent story backing them up each and every one of them so what i'd recommend is like don't try not to downgrade the graphics but don't make it the main focal point i mean at one stage i was looking at a random gravestone and it just seemed to have no other purpose than showing off the background blur the, 
the focus thing, if that makes any sense. It just seemed kind of pointless. It just seemed to show off an unnecessary feature, in my opinion. But, like, for a starter demo, yeah, it was, it was okay. It was, it was all right. I know my thoughts are all over the place, but, you know what, guys, try it out for yourselves. See what you think. Try it out with a mouse and keyboard. And uh, let, let me know how it went for you. Because I'm... I'm I really want to know other people's feedback on this game. I mean, I'm I'm probably coming off too harsh, but then again, that's me. I am a sick little bastard. Anywho, guys, that is enough rambling from me. God knows uh, I know I spoke too long there. Yikes. Keep it short and sweet to the point, Robbie boy. So, anyway, you know what to do. If you did enjoy this video by some freaking miracle, be sure to give it a massive thumbs up, comment, favorite, share, let me know what you thought of the video. And of course, like always, I will see you guys in the next one. So until next time. See ya.